fragrant spices. Cinnamon, from farm to fork. Cinnamon is one of our favourite spices and a very familiar flavour. You might have tasted it on your porridge, in a bun or sprinkled it on your hot chocolate. But have you ever wondered where it comes from? It's perhaps a little bit surprising, but this fragrant spice is actually the bark of these trees. It grows here, in these lush green forests, in a country called Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka is in Asia, in the Indian Ocean. Sometimes it is referred to as the teardrop of India, because if you look at it on a map, it looks a little bit like a droplet falling from the coast of India. The cinnamon plants grow well along the southwest coast of Sri Lanka and in the low hills. This is because they are both areas where the heavy monsoon rain falls, making them very humid and green. After being planted, the cinnamon tree takes around two years to grow to be 12 to 15 feet tall. Once they reach this height, the farmers know they are ready to be harvested. The farmers are continually planting new cinnamon plants to make sure they always have enough to keep up with demand. The cinnamon farmers train the plants to grow as straight as possible. They do this because straight branches mean straight sticks of cinnamon. The cinnamon here in Sri Lanka is harvested by hand, using a blade like a machete. It's very hard work, especially as Sri Lanka is such a hot and humid country. But the people who do it are very skilled at it. Once it has been cut down, it's tied together and then loaded onto a truck like this before being taken to the peeling factory to remove the bark. First, the branches are dipped in water to soften the bark. Then this man, called a peeler, removes knots from the branch as well as the outer bark. Peeling the bark from the branch is a very skilled job and is a traditional Sri Lankan occupation. Then the fragrant inner bark is peeled off and packed together like this. The bark naturally curls together, forming sticks that are called cinnamon quills. The quills are placed high up near the ceiling and left to dry in the heat of the day. They are then bundled up before being weighed and packed into containers to send to the UK. After about three weeks at sea, the cinnamon arrives at the UK factory. It is checked for quality in the laboratory. And then the most flawless sticks are packed by hand into jars. Less perfect looking sticks, which still taste and smell the same, are ground up in this special bark mill. Once the cinnamon has been milled into a powder, it is put into jars using this machine. Finally, the jars of ground cinnamon are ready to embark on the final part of their journey being sent to the store for you to buy and enjoy at home.